Hey everyone and welcome to today's tutorial. In this video I will show you step by step how to connect your Qcoin account to the CoinStats app. Now without further ado, let's get right into it. So the first thing you need to do, if you want to track your Qcoin wallet, is to go over to the icon in the top right, looking similar to this one, and then you want to go over to API management. You will then be sent over to a page looking similar to this one, and you want to click on create API. And you will then be sent over to this page. Now you want to go ahead and give your API key a name. For me, this will be CoinStats. And you can then also go ahead and give your API a passphrase. This is kind of like the password to access your API key, and it needs to be between 7 and 32 characters. Now once you've given your API key a name and filled in the API passphrase, you can scroll down and go over to the API restrictions. Now you want to make sure that only general is checked. So if either trade or transfer is checked, Make sure to uncheck them and you can then go over to IP restriction and you want to click on no. Even though it's not recommended because if you do say yes there's a chance it won't work. So you can then go ahead and click on next and you'll then have to go through the security verification process. So you just need to fill in your trading password, the email verification code and the 2FA code generated in the Google Authenticator if you do have the Google Authenticator connected to Qcoin. And once you fill those codes in, you need to go ahead and click on confirm. You'll then get this pop up and as you can see your API key has been created. Below that you'll see the API key name and you now want to go over to your phone and install the CoinStats app. Now once you open the app up for the first time, you get a screen looking similar to this one. And you want to click on get started. And then you want to go over to the search bar and search for the exchange you would like to connect. In this case that's Qcoin. Then you just want to click on Qcoin. Now unfortunately, in contrary to Binance, Qcoin does not support the QR code. So what you need to do is to get your key and your secret key over to your phone manually. You can do this by sending yourself a WhatsApp or sending an email to your own email address. And yes, that actually works. Now please be aware that if you decide to share your key or your secret to other people, those people with the keys will be able to connect their CoinStats account or any other portfolio tracker to your Qcoin account as well. So you actually don't want to share this code with anyone, however I am going to share it with you guys, because after this video I'll go ahead and delete my API key. So the next thing you need to do is to paste your key and your secret, and once you've done that, you need to click on passphrase and fill in your passphrase. So that's the code you just filled in. And once you fill that in, you just need to click on submit, and you'll then see that it might take up to a few seconds to connect Qcoin to CoinStats. You then get some quotes which I am not going to read and once it's loaded you'll see that your Qcoin account now has been visible or imported onto the CoinStats app. If you found this video helpful let me know by leaving a like or subscribing to my channel for more tutorials about cryptocurrencies.